All right, we are back. Tokyo Vice time. And it's time to walk really fast away from this little girl. Yes. And not talk to these people. Because they all want us to do side quests. Yeah. I'm sure of it. Yes. I hit the wrong button. Yeah. Curse you, Zelda. Owl. Date, I know you're that Zelda owl. You leave me alone. I should look it up. Well, that's kind of spoilers if I know how long this game is, I guess. I don't know. George Washington Bridge. I gotta jump off onto a trailer. No. Tanker. It's a T word. Is this a stealth sequence? You're allowed to see me? Are you Fuma? As planned. You gotta remember this. Terada Oyabun never fails to pay off his debts. It's like they knew that Game of Thrones shit was coming out. Like, check this out. We're gonna get in on this ground floor early. Uh. What? I mean, I know it's illicit. You guys are in the Japanese Mafia. I know what the Yakuza is. We better do a safety. God. Last episode I couldn't hit the button. This episode I can't hit the button. No, I guess that was this episode. Still can't hit the button. Did, now I'm, did it save? I don't think it did, because this is chapter 12. There we go. Wait for me. What? What is this guy, Mr. Yeah. Briefcase? Well, it's a good thing I bought it in town. Look at this crap. What does it do? I don't care how hard of a time you had to get it. What does it do? Oh, I cannot wait to get rid of this little girl. That man. I think that's the man who saved me at the batting cage. Well, that was nice of him. We should go thank him. Talk Maybe he'll be appreciative of these stuffed animals that I won. I won them for you. You didn't even your on, appreciation okay. meter didn't fill up at all. You little jerk, girl. Is there a locker key over here I can use? Actually, hmm, if I see a locker key, does that mean the game we go back? I would assume that's what that means. That or the game has some sort of a new game plus. Good evening, cousin Masan. Hey, what's up? I'm Terida, a lieutenant of the Omi family. What? Tell me. Why is the Omi family helping Fuma Oyu? I beat up some of your dudes like in the beginning of the game. I owe Fuma San a lot. Fumasan is waiting for you. Follow me. Alright. Fuma's the guy that helped us out, right? It got us out of prison and met us you up? Made it. Yes. Okay. Kazuma. Mustache Fuma. man. I'm glad you're alright. I apologize for putting you through all this trouble. <laughs> the man you just met, Terada, he used to be an assassin. He Just wasn't like very me. good at it. I see. He I kept greeting people and showing them into my room. Him being a lieutenant in the Omi family. Especially Nishiki. Cosma, listen. I'm going to tell you Why about do you have an IV, that's Dom? been concealed for the past ten years. Is, okay? that, is that for me? Yes. Oh, exposition, this Dom. This girl's mother, Mizuki, doesn't exist. What? The dead lady in the Yumi. river actually was your mother. Yumi is Mizuki. <gasps> the woman you've been looking for, Mizuki, you... is in fact What? Yumi. No, really? What are you saying? 
Also, you you're her father. To be Mizuki for the last five years. That means Haruka's mother is her aunt. Yumi. She is definitely Yumi's daughter. No doubt about it. So Yumi isn't my aunt. She's really my mother? Oyabun. Who's Yumi's partner? I mean, Haruka's father. Wait, they were saying partner back then? Yohei Jingu. What? Jingu. I'm actually Yumi shocked. From the MBI. I swore it was going to be him. Well, good. I don't have to keep one in brownie points with you. Ago. The baby Yumi is holding is Haruka. What's up with the dude's bullet hole? Beside them What's up with dude's bullet Jingo. hole in the middle of his forehead? You know that Yumi lost her memory due to shock caused by the shooting, don't you? Yes. No. After that's not a way. That's not how that works. Yumi was scared and confused. She just ran from the hospital, but she did remember one thing. She remembered where the Sunflower Orphanage was, where she was born and raised. So you're telling me. She was After visiting this little news, girl and telling her that she was her aunt, but didn't have any memory of her? To help her what? Gain her memory. I showed her a bunch of pictures. What's wrong? These pictures, they're just random pictures from the internet. Mm -hmm. I love Rain. Lightning. He's my favorite Korean singer. It was very well acted emotion there. I don't know. I don't. No. At that point, it hit me. I realized who really killed Dojima. And the, after the that, little girl. I decided not to tell Nishiki about Yumi. Oh shit, I didn't see all the bloody bandages. Must have had a hard time there, but Fuma. How did Yumi end up with Jingu? Jingu and Sarah were pretty tight. Jingu used to do business. Guys, I gotta be honest, I have no idea who the fuck Yumi Jingu is. Met. I have no clue who this guy is. Jingu and the chairman? Jingu was trying to get involved in the political world. Sarah was the man behind the scenes. No idea who this guy is. Jingu met Yumi. I guess we gotta go fight him. Since Yumi had no recollection of her past, it wasn't hard for Jingu to fill that spiritual void that she was feeling. I couldn't do it. With his heart. penis. I thought that if she could live happily with Jingu, she could escape the world of organized crime. I thought Sorry, that was uncalled for. That was, that was an easy shot. With Low hanging fruit. Mind, I felt the like his balls. The no, I'm sorry. I gotta stop. Jingu. That's not. Nope. Then Yumi and Jingu had a child, Haruka. One day, some jerks talking through all this exposition, making stupid jokes. Proposal from the prime minister's daughter. That's when Yumi decided to leave him, since they weren't officially married. She did it for Jingu. But. That decision started the House of Cards toppling. With Kevin Spacey? Jingu had acquired power through marriage and not of his own accord. So in order to maintain that status, he became ruthless. All the while justifying it to himself. After their breakup, I was looking after Yumi and Haruka. This cutscene's gonna be the whole damn episode, isn't it? Day, Sarah received an urgent call from Jingu. Gotta help me out. I'm in deep shit. <laughs> What's the problem? Just get over here. I'll send some men. Where are you? No. I need you to come alone. Oh, that's not a trap. What the hell happened? That's not a trap at all. There's a body that needs to be taken care of. Uh, so I'll send some men. I don't deal with that shit directly, you idiot. Jingu insisted it was just an accident. The body was of a freelance reporter who was trying to blackmail Jingu. He was going to write a story exposing the truth about Yumi and Haruka. I'm surprised this man's alive. This has got to be a trap, right? And burned them. But for Jingu, it wasn't over yet. Now, is everything settled? Well, there it comes. Exactly. 
There's one more thing that needs to be taken care of. I need you to get in that hole. To prevent this from happening again, there are two others that also need to be dealt with. What? You mean... Seta, this is to protect our future. We must. Jingu. Jingu. Wah, 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 wah. Dang, we're ten minutes in. It is. This is gonna be the whole episode. What do you think you're doing? Chairman. Fumasan. I made a promise. Jingu. You were, your word so important. You were just in this lady's room? That you would kill a girl and her baby to keep it? Nothing can be that important. Did she not notice you <laughs> this guy being in here? Lucky for Yumi, or maybe unlucky, she regained her memory at that very instant. Of course she did. Of course she did. No, it's it's Yumi and Haruka. it's convenient for the Jingu. plot to happen like that. The heartless son of a bitch. I persuaded Sarah to put Yumi and Haruka into hiding, where Jingu would never find them. So that's how Mizuki and Ares came to be. Yes. Sarah and I arranged to have Haruka I don't remember Warp Guy at any point Yumi's in time name. in this game. We hired a counterfeiter to forge all the necessary documents. We also altered the way she looked. Face, hair. But, Oyobun, why did Yumi steal 10 billion from the Tojo clan? That wasn't the Tojo clan's money. It was Jingu's. Bumasan, the Shimano family is outside. It's not safe here. It's never safe here. Damn Shimano. That crazy bastard. Well, let's try to put some action in this episode. Uh, yeah, I would... Nope, oh, that was trying to save. If I die, I do not want to have to watch all that cutscenes again. God, come on. No. I want to save. Yes. There we go. Cool. Cool. Guess I go this way. Thought it was supposed to start you to initiate the fight, but okay. Which, which one is the guys that we're fighting? The suits or the goofy clothes? Looks like the suits. They have a lot of grenades. Hey, there he is. Kazuma. Hey, what's up? We're on a team, right? Aw, oh, dang it. Aw, oh, nuts, guys! Oh, my PS2 face. Oh, there's the good music. This is a grenade. Okay, get up. Oh, I need to use my upgrade, too. Nope, that's not how you do that. Do I just throw it? I guess you just throw it. Let's power up, too. Uh, solar technique. A giant swing or a steel mine? What does a steel mine do? Let's find out. Oh, nice. 
I'll take an extended heat gauge. No, please pick up the bat. Or a grenade, that'll work, I guess. Wow, wow, that does a lot of damage. I didn't actually notice that guy's health the last time I did that. Okay. Please face the man. Thank you. You're number one! Right, we did it, right? We don't have to fight the guys on the docks. We, we, we won. Okay, I guess they actually were supposed to be grenades that they were throwing the entire time. You wouldn't think you'd need that many. Everyone else is still on the boat. Haruka's on the boat. Fumo Yabun is on the boat. Kazuma-san. Okay, never mind. Are I, you okay, Uncle Kazuma? Yeah. I guess you guys took the back door. Too close for comfort, though. What is going on? How did they get off of that boat? No, oh, we took the back door too, Kazuma. Think you're the only one who knows about the back door on the docks? The what tattoos fun. are really nice. I do we like them. Again. They're, they're really cool. Kazuma. And Fuma. I like the niche he's got the koi. Or the carp. Because he's like, oh, this dude's got a fish. And he's like, oh, oh, he kicked my ass. Tirada, you pretended to betray Nishiki and take sides with me. But I saw right through your deception. I've been watching you the whole time. And oh, that face! You, and you left yourselves open. I'll take the girl, if it's all right with you. It's really a shame that you all have to die. Shimano, what? It's you that left yourself open. L literally, you took your shirt off. Oh, hit him with the truck! What's this shit? No, don't! Oh, you again. Just run him over! It's almost Christmas. So we brought some presents. Why didn't you just hit him? If you're gonna fight anyway, just kill the man. Kazuma, looks like you've been having one hell of a time. Who are yeah, you? So do you. I don't know who any of you people are, and looks that like might be on me bad. not like really paying attention to the story. All right then, let the massacre begin. Well, guys, I'm sorry, but the massacre is gonna have to wait till next time. This has been a long episode, especially for Tuesday. Assuming I remember to actually upload it on the Tuesday. Um, yep, we're gonna pause it there. Uh, it's gonna pick back up tomorrow, right here, and we'll see you then on Tokyo Vice.